Chelsea won the first corner of the game, taken by Fabregas, headed away by Granit Xhaka. And Alonso is in behind here too, and it's a deflection which takes it behind for a corner, the second of the game. Really including Ruby Gurley and Happy Yoko. Here yet, here's Victor Moses, and he's in behind too. His shot saved by Ospina, it was a pretty tame effort in the end from Victor Moses. And Chelsea have already given Arsenal a few walks Asia. Given away cheaply by Maitland Niles and William is away here. He's got support but he might not need it. Well it was close. And Arsenal have got away with one. 12 goals last season, you would have expected him to put that away. Yeah, Maitland Niles here, just a sloppy touch. He's not concentrating enough, he's not, not decisive enough with the ball. He recovers well, I have to say. He gets him just enough pressure on Willian there, just to put him under enough pressure to force him to squeeze it well. But really a chance miss by Willian. Nice and sharp. This is Moses. Decent looking cross. That's sure I seem to be caught in two minds. I don't think he realised that it was going to swing back out again. They've kept it in here, Chelsea. Alonso. Stretch for Fabregas. Willian takes over. Here we are, it stays on side, but just a slid ball there to William puts him in a, probably a better position to score. You know, you, you don't mind your striker. This is Iwobi. That's all with Lacazette. And also Aaron Ramsey arriving late and prodding it narrowly wide. In the attack, he makes a lovely run, and no one better than Ozil to find him with these type of passes. Great passing between the two defenders. And comes a long way to deal with it and does so successfully. Might come here for William. Does come for William. Still going. It's William. It's a save by David Ospina. Victor Moses. And another reaction save by the Colombian goalkeeper to keep Chelsea out. They've looked the most likely. Another poor kind of error from Arsenal for him. He's only going to bring more opportunities to score, but with his goal, I'm not sure he'll take. And that was superb from Batshuayi. He's found William. Boger is joining the attack. Moses is there too. William goes for goal himself. And this time Chelsea did take the lead. Really good finish from William. They have been threatening to take. Five minutes before half time. And William, who scored a hat trick against Fulham last weekend. He's on the score sheet once more. Monreal has to keep him going on the outside. As, as a defender, the only place I don't want him coming is inside. I will gladly let him go on the outside of me there and show him to the goal line. He allows him that space inside. Someone like William only needs half an opportunity or half a yard to bend the ball in the far post. He's ahead of Bramall. Just got a little bit uh, befuddled. Here is Batshuayi. Some space for him too. And Chelsea score a double in quick succession. First Willian and then Batshuayi. Chelsea again handed the ball from Bramall, I think it was, and developed it themselves. But the, the initial turnover of the ball was it was a real sloppy touch or sloppy play from Bramall. Kante doesn't need a, a, another opportunity to dispossess somebody. And, you know, it's a very composed finish. Mertesacker's body weight's going the wrong way. Cuts inside. Very similar finish to William. Shouts himself for so long. He's got Lozenby, especially now. Here's Ramsey. Trying to beat Thibaut Courtois, who had to be. Shouts himself for so long. He's got Lozenby, especially now. Here's Ramsey. Trying to beat Thibaut Courtois, who had to be. And Fantastic ball in from Oxlade Chamberlain. Nice touch from Ramsey. He just picks up that lovely position in Fabregas and he's some composure. And picking out a beautiful pass for Marcus Alonso, who leaves Oxlade Chamberlain on the floor. Alonso, and it's hit beautifully by Michi Batshuayi. It's three goals for Chelsea and Arsenal. Excellent ball from Fabregas, I must say. Really put Arsenal on the back foot. And, and Chamberlain doesn't 
get the brakes on well enough there, maybe the pitch has something to do with that, but take nothing away from that finish. Arriving on the edge of the box, it's a nice way to pass here from Alonso, and just to sweep that with his left foot with a bit of bend on it. It's going to be Ramsey, or is it Giroud through the wall? No. He tries to disguise it in the end, it's come to nothing. Elneny playing in Ertzel, was onside here, can he produce a cross, oh it's through. Aaron Ramsey's legs, comes back out and Coquelin ripples the top of the net. Get the situations where I just love Ozil's quality. You know, we spoke about him earlier and that about not doing enough, but these, you know, he, he always picks people out. There's never just a hopeful ball into the box. It's a great cutback. Should make better contact, but I'm not sure if Caviar just gets a bit of a... No. Got away from El Nenik. And Ospina is to the rescue. Herzl, Giroud. Still Olivier Giroud. Almost wasn't allowed to come on at half time. Conte. Oga. Conte again. Vampigas. Oh, it's a really good take. Super take. And almost finished off too. Wenger, he said he's going to use the kids in that competition. Here's Giroud, onside. Couldn't quite return it to Danny Welbeck. Is that the right philosophy for you?